We're gonna try and play it, and it does not help me emotionally knowing that, uh, um, okay, so Jimmy can't touch you if, uh, he's not on the floor. It takes him a while to get to the floor that you're on, so we're gonna move into the room. We're gonna open this door. There's nothing in here. Perfect. Great. Uh, we're gonna go back out, because I'm pretty sure he's not here yet, and, uh, I hate the fucking way this thing moves. So, he can't he here yet. Oh shit, closed out. One sec. Um, this way. We're gonna open this door, and it's this door. And I'm gonna leave the room now because it's way too damn dark. And he can't be on here yet. So, is there a door here? We have the room key here. Perfect. And we're gonna search inside. Ooh, we got the compass. Okay, perfect. We needed the compass. Um, there's nothing in there. So, uh, can we open the other door? And we got a key to the stairs on floor one. So, try key, open the inventory face. Doors can be locked or unlocked with the right key. Okay, so Jimmy is not yet on here in, in this, uh, Floor. It doesn't look like because he hasn't uh, haunted us yet. But we're going to look through the spyglass anyway. Um, nothing. Okay, perfect. We're going to go ahead and leave the room. Emotionally, I'm not ready for that. But you need to find this crying mirror. I know. I heard you the first time, game. I did. Um, if Jimmy kills us, we don't die in real life. So that's the relief. That's the relief. Really, it is. Uh, oh, we went into the bathroom on accident. My bad, y'all. Okay. <laughs> All right. Jimmy Hall is in the oh, it's on the floor looking for you. Stay away from him. Okay, so now he's on the floor. Perfect. Um, I want to try and call out to him. So, uh, so he comes. No. Do I want that? He's on the floor. He's looking for me. What do I want to do? I'm terrified already. Um, Jimmy can be heard walking nearby, but is he close enough that, um, is he close enough that it's going to make me terrified for the rest of my life? I don't know. Um, okay. So I need to make sure that this is me. Oh my God. He just walked by. Okay. So he's moving. We know he went that way. Um, yeah. Uh, <laughs> this is emotionally too much already. Okay. So we're going to go ahead. And we're going to leave the room. Because fuck you, Jimmy. We're not. Okay. <laughs> didn't mean to... I didn't mean to do that. Okay. Let's make. I didn't mean to go right back in. Of course I did. Go back in though. Um. Okay, weird noises inside my house. Perfect, wonderful, gorgeous, lovely. Um, we gotta, we gotta make our ways outside of the room, and we gotta get back to the. We gotta get back to the. What, what floor do we have to get back to? We have to get to the. Okay, we're already on the floor that we need to be on, but Jimmy's on this floor, and that makes me anxious as hell. Um, he's calling for me, as you can hear him. He said, come out now, which is very uncomforting, very discomforting. I don't want to come. I don't want to be here. I'm going to go ahead and... Hey! So, we're hiding in the bathroom because fuck Jimmy. And we called him, he came, but we're gonna be fine. My emotions are over, my heart is hammering. Um, oh, fuck, well, we died. <laughs> well, that's one way to, to do things. I didn't expect to die immediately, but we did, you know, not live. <laughs> We've already died once. So it can't be that bad from here on, right? Right. Right. 
Did he just beat us? Did he just hit us? We're not dead? What? Okay. Hide in the bathroom or look through the spyglass. I'm very confused. Did we not die? Because I thought we were dead. Um, look in the first floor store near the, the, the voices. Okay. So we're just going to leave because we're in a dark room right now. What room did he put us in? We're in 107. Um, we found a purse, so that's a thing we found, and we found the storeroom to 106, which should help us to find things. I'm glad that we died. I know that sounds morbid. Really glad we died, though, because I, uh, <laughs> I couldn't handle it if I didn't handle a single death. I really wouldn't have been able to, um... I've already died, so the scary part has happened. Hi, Dexter. And, you know, he can't really get me anymore. So there's that. The store door is not working. Um, we're gonna leave again, because it's too dark. I really don't like the way this is moving. What is it? Will 107, like, start to be bright? Nope, we don't have the key for it yet. Um, so Jimmy was on the floor. He hit us already. So I assume that we're going to be all right. And we're going to go into room 108 and uh, openly search. Nothing. Nothing's in here. We were in room 107. We were in room... Look in the first floor near the stairs for the device. Look on the first floor near the stairs for the device. Okay. It would be helpful if the hall was not as um, totally cr crappy as it is. 109. Let's try 109. 109 is open. He got us. Okay. We found a sword. Why can't I take the sword? <laughs> Let's uh... You noted the sword, we noted the sword. Look through the spyglass. I don't think that he's still on the floor with us. Okay, he can be heard walking by. I'm gonna go ahead and we're gonna watch. Okay, so he's walking, he looked through the glass. Uh, sometimes he does a double pass, so we're gonna go ahead and just wait. We're gonna wait. He knows we're on the floor. Um, we want to be big, strong people about things. And we don't want to die. He joined us again on the floor, which is unpleasant. It's extremely unpleasant. But it's not something that we can't handle. So we're going to handle it. We're going to go ahead and we're going to try and handle it. It looks like he's moved away. So we're going to open the door. And, you know, if he gets us, he gets us, and that's, you know, sucks. <laughs> sucks. That's how I handle things. Why am I here? Oh, beautiful. Gorgeous. Um, we're trapped. Is he here? I'm going to enter 108 just to be secure. Um, I'm going to look through the glass. Um, I don't hear him anywhere nearby, so he can't be close to us, um, I think. But it doesn't mean he's not looking for us. Um, okay, We're going to have to continue to venture out in order to get there. And it looks like I did a good job of ramming myself into the back. Um, so that's uncomforting. This is very uncomfortable right here. Um, but 
I died once, and so the bad part has already happened, and I can emotionally feel secure moving through. Oh, I'm saying it's the letter. It's not the letter. It is... Oh, he's, he's on the floor again. Um, that dead of night. Done. Sorry. Sorry about that. So he's on the floor again, and we heard him just now, which means that he is undoubtedly um, close by, ready to strike at any moment. Um, Tony can be heard. He's walking around. I prefer to play it safe. He does event, he moves around on his own, uh, especially on the floor. So we want to make sure that he, we don't want him to be too close to us. Um, we want to be able to move out. We want to be able to move out. That's what we want to do. We want to wait. We want to wait. We want to wait. We want to play the waiting game. We're strong at the waiting game. That's. That's the A plus game that we know how to play. We can handle this. It doesn't look like he came any closer than what I originally thought he was gonna come. Um, so I'm a little disappointed. I was hoping that he would at least pass by so I would be able to run and securely know that he was not following. But it doesn't look like we're gonna get that opportunity. Um, it does look like he knows where I am when I call for him, which is un conventional. It's not something that I like. It's not something that I want. But he was heard walking by recently. And so, okay, he's close. He's close. I, you know, come closer. Walk by. <laughs> what I want. <laughs> Walk by. Okay. He's walking by. He's looking through the looking glass. He can't really see anything. I don't give a crap. Bye, Jimmy. Okay. So he walked by. We're gonna leave. We're gonna, okay, so. Um, bye. Okay, he's moving really quick. We're gonna hide in the bathroom. He did walk in. He did walk into the room. So the door closed. But is it one of the situations where he's like waiting because he knows we're in here or what? He's chasing us. That is obvious. I walked out and then he he came back. He came back really fast. <laughs> Very uncomfortable. Okay. But we just had our interaction with him, so he can't he can't really be that close to us, can he? Um we have to get to the stairs. We have to get to the stairs. Okay. I hear him. He's still close by. This is uncomfortable. Okay. We're gonna leave. Look through the first store near the stairs for the device. So he wants us in room 107, I think. Okay. We're just gonna have to book it. Room 107 is too dark. You can be heard somewhere, but not close by, I think. So, we're probably safe to continue moving. This is a lot. Emotionally, this is a lot. <laughs> okay. Um, he went pretty quiet, so I don't think he's very close by. 
we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna leave again and we're gonna try and go into room 107 I mean 106 sorry room 106 not room 107 so leave the room that way okay we're in the store and our only option is to leave the room but I swear I just heard him so I don't want to is it better to be in the dark We can do this. 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 He's gonna kill us. We're playing it by ear at this point. He's walking by. But I can't hear him, that's the thing. Learn something today, don't hide in the store. Because you can't see shit. <laughs> he walked by a while ago, I wonder if it's safe to move. He's hurt. He walked by again, just real close. So let's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, so he's still nearby. Oh, this is not nice. I don't like this. And I'm in the dark. I'm literally in the dark. I don't know what to do. Um, okay. Excuse me. Sorry about that. I'm sorry. Fear allergies, you know. They go crazy this time of year. Okay. We can do this. Excuse me. Sorry. I'm allergic to fear. No, we don't want to go that way. Shit, not this way. When one one thirteen looked promising, but she wasn't. So we're going to try and go directly across and maybe that one's more profitable than this one. I don't think Jimmy's at all close. <laughs> you know, who just runs a haunted hotel to kill people? You know, besides Bates, you know, besides the really crazy, creepy people, you know. I guess he fits the mold. Why did I ask that question? That was a dumb question. We can do this. Okay. He's somewhere, but I don't think he's close to us. I can see. No, you can't. Shut the fuck up. Okay. <laughs> we already died once. We suffered the worst death. We called him. He came. He killed us. We can't die worst death, I think. 
Um, so, <laughs> we're gonna, you know, you're here. Yeah, well, shut up. Just walk by already. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. He hasn't made noise for twelve Mississippis, so. He's still walking around, but it sounds like he's getting more distance. Yeah, he's getting more distant. Okay, so we got the labeled storeroom. Nice. And we already have the compass. But we have a bottle of turpentine and liquor now. So that's cool, right? Like, yeah. And I guess the wardrobe is just for hiding. So we were already in 113. We don't need to go there again. Seems like he's distant enough away from us that we could probably go through the hall and be safe. Um, but do, am I too much of a coward to do it, probably. Um, okay, go back outside. Let's see what 114 has for us. It's too dark. Didn't mean to look through the spyglass, just meant to leave. Let's try 115. Okay, let's see what's in here, suitcases, okay, um, okay, there are in fact suitcases in 115, okay, 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 I don't think Jimmy's on this, uh, hallway right now, so, could probably escape without um, dying. Uh, so <laughs> What's one twenty? I feel comfortable right now. Okay, so we found trophies, we found awards, but we haven't found the scrying thingy. So. Okay, so he's close. He is close. Now, we, we just heard him like make a very audible noise. So he's close. And he walked by. He looked really angry when he walked by. I feel like he's gonna walk by again. So. We're getting the, we're getting the, the moves on Jimmy Jam here. We're moving on. We're, we're going, we're going places. We're escaping from this horrible, terrible, terrible person who wants to kill us this clown man with a mop for a head that is what we are escaping from and we're doing it in style y'all uh i feel like we're done we're we did diddle dang doing a decent job of uh, keeping it real <laughs> okay so i haven't heard him in a minute so let's just count to 12 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12. I don't think he's here anymore. Okay. And then I hear him. So 
It does sound like he went a little bit more distant though. So I feel like we could probably escape. So we're gonna try and escape. He was here. He heard me. He definitely heard me. But it doesn't look like he heard me do anything. So, I open these drawers. We found room. We found the deadlock key to room 119. Okay, and what does the deadlock key do? That's what I want to know. He's calling my name. He's like, Nyla. I mean, my name is Sue, but he doesn't know that. So <laughs> this is horrifying. He's somewhere. He's looking for me. And what do these notes have? Okay. So we've got, okay. We locked the door. We're safe. <laughs> so that's cool. <laughs> um, let's see. What can we do? What can we do? It does look. Hi, Tahaldra. How are you doing? <laughs> As you can see, we're hiding from a murderer. He's looking for us. Yeah, we are being hunted in a haunted hotel. And, um, well, I don't know if it's haunted. No, it is haunted. There was a dead ghost in the basement. So that's fun. <laughs> oh, okay. Hi, Teal. Nice to meet you. It is a little bit easier. Um, okay, so I think he's not anywhere close to us. We're gonna try and dive for the other room. Okay, so let's leave the room. I'm doing good. I was, okay, I've gotta unlock the door, it says. So we're gonna go ahead and unlock the door. So the door is unlocked. He can now get us, but it's fine, I think. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna walk out. We're gonna turn around. He's not here. We're gonna try the door to the store. <gasps> we, okay, so we found it. The door to the store is in fact bright. It's really bright in here. Um, what am I supposed to get in the store? I don't even remember. <laughs> they are horns, but they move. So that's fun, right? Okay. So the store doesn't look like it was very profitable for us. So we're just going to go ahead and we're going to move on to room 118 and room 1008 is really dark. So we're going to just leave <laughs> room 118. That was too much. Uh, I don't want to die again. I do not want to die again. Okay. But how do I get to the stairs is the question. Okay. We were at 117 a while ago. We don't need to be there again. Okay. Is this a store? I think it is. Okay, how do I get to the damn stairs? Okay, 121. I don't think I was in 121 at any point. So we're gonna go in. And it doesn't look like Jimmy has found us here yet. Nothing, nothing. Nothing for our hard work. Great, love it. Uh, nope, nothing's in here. Perfect. Uh, <laughs> um, yeah, um, my character is definitely, she's wearing horns, she's a magical girl. Uh, okay, so, holy shit, holy fuck, holy crap, Knuckles, <laughs> okay. Hide in the bathroom, I think. Yeah, okay, so you saw him, he saw us, and then... He hid, and so we're hiding now because we don't want to die. <laughs> we don't want to die. We don't want to do that. Okay, so he's walking by. I like the design. Did you come up with it yourself? My brother's actually the one who made this the 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 avatar for me. 
Um, so he's the one who came up with the design and the concept. All I did was, you know, I want her to be a magical girl. I want her to have a dark dress and I want her to have white hair. And I was, that was it. I threw it at him. I actually gave him a lot more, but he wired it down to different, um, aspects because he's really strong in character design because he's actually a game designer. So, uh, <laughs> he made the character for me after a very thorough and rigorous pro 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 process. There we go. Thank you. Hi, Arliss. Nice to meet you. Thank you so much for joining us on our stream. It's nice. <laughs> um, we're trying to get to the stairs before Jimmy, uh, Jimmy Jam kills us. And... He's looking for us, that's for sure. Uh, <laughs> yeah, it's this game. <laughs> um, okay, so we found the trophies already. The trophies were here. How are y'all doing? Nice to see y'all. Nice to have y'all with me today on my um, fearful journey through the hotel to find the dang old scrying thing in my bobber. Uh, I don't know where the stairs are. I've already gotten lost. I get lost through places like this with ease. So we're going to go ahead and leave. <laughs> oh, thank you so much. I was just telling uh, Teal here that my brother was the one who designed uh, my avatar for me. Okay, so we're trying to move through here all stealth-like and whatnot. He's fucking moving. So we're moving. We're going into the bathroom. We're hiding. Okay. So... <laughs> okay. He... He did... He's coming into the room. Oh my goodness. Okay. 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 <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> well, my brother does, um, he makes VTubers. If you guys are ever interested, uh, let me see if I can uh, <laughs> get you the link at some point for him. <laughs> okay, awesome. <laughs> awesome, awesome sauce. Uh, I'm sure that you will be able to improve really quickly. Um, I think uh, my own art skills improve it drastically every single... Oh, thank you so much for following um, Ar Arla. That's... <laughs> I appreciate it so much. Okay, so Jimmy moved and my heart is still racing. And he's really freaking close because he was... I was that was pretty auditory. Um, but I have to get to the stairs. I have to get to the stairs. I have to get to the stairs. Um, <laughs> we're working on improving slowly. Your, I'm sure that your art is great. I want to see your art at some point. So, <laughs> I'll. Um, do you do art streams? Let me know. Okay, we're gonna walk on through, and if we hear him moving around real quickly, then we're just gonna. Oh, thank God. Thank Jesus. Uh, no, no, no. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, okay, okay. We're here. We're, we're by the stairs. Okay, that scared me. He made a noise and he came. Okay, so we're gonna we're gonna just go to the lower ground floor. <gasps> oh, yeah. Okay, he was right there. Oh my god, he was right there. Okay, we're fine. I'm sorry. I got anxiety. My anxiety spikes so hard. Um in horror games. I just went to the lower floor because I actually know it's like freaking safe. So that's, that's why I went there. <laughs> no, you're not safe near the elevator. He can get you on the elevator. Um, but you are safe on ground floor one and you are safe on the, the floor, uh, the lower floor. <laughs> I almost got jumped. I was so stressed. I was so stressed. I don't know why he doesn't um, come to the ground floor. Um, let me see. Uh, and I 
can interact with the laundry room. Awesome. I don't stream or not yet. I'm still thinking of it. May my next work will be designing my avatar if, if I don't stream. I think that would be awesome. If you ever do stream the process of making your avatar, I totally want to check in and watch. <laughs> I'm eternally staying at floor one. Goodbye. God, that's such a mood. Um, the good thing about it is that Jim, Jimmy Jam cannot, that's the character's name, by the way, Jimmy Jam, he uh, cannot actively uh, move from floor to floor very fast. So if you go from floor one to floor three, it's going to take him a while to get to floor three. Um, so you can play that up to protect you a little bit better. Let's see what's over here. Uh, is there anything I can interact with that I couldn't interact with before? Before. That is not the right key. It doesn't work. Okay. Um, key to a storeroom. And it's not the right key. Awesome. Uh, so, <laughs> Jimmy Jam. Jamboree! <laughs> Uh, I didn't so I don't don't know where I can send you some art okay uh, let me see okay uh, let me see if I can make the mod so that you can like send it uh, let me real quick let me just see if um, mod I think the let me see if I can remember the proper way to do this <laughs> mod allow which uh allow link okay so if i'm correct if i remember how to do this correctly uh you don't have links dangerang okay um <laughs> let's see i do have my i do have a very small discord chat and by that i mean nobody's in it uh, but if you were ever interested in like <laughs> sending your art or your images through that then like by all means do it let me just go ahead and i'll get you the link to the chat you don't have to stay in it forever um as soon as you send it you can just leave i don't care <laughs> but i have it there available um just in case because i'm very terrible at doing things and uh copy okay so i'm just gonna send you the link <laughs> Love that you're doing this while Jimmy Jam is hunting you down. <laughs> Thank you. I appreciate it. <laughs> There's literally nobody in the chat. That's why, I mean, I don't really, like, have anybody in there to interact with. So... Uh, thank you. I also do art streams from time to time, but today I was like, you're facing your fears. You are gonna, you're gonna do stuff today, unfortunately. Okay, so we have the stairs floor one. Nope, not working. Awesome. Love that. It's all right. Yeah, you can go ahead and jump in. Uh, everybody can jump in uh, and we can all look at this beautiful art together. <laughs> And I'm gonna stay on a safe floor. <laughs> I'm gonna stay on a very nice safe floor. Hi there. Just quickly send a hi. And I don't actually have it all cooped out. There's nothing really going on in here, but <laughs> there I am. <laughs> okay, if you, <laughs> yeah, I think that would be great. I love art, I love seeing art, and I want to see more art and I'm very terrible at uh, working Twitch, so Discord is working out for me right now. <laughs> Jim Jom's band from Floor One. And it's weird because, you know, it's actually his hotel and whatnot. But we're going to go ahead and we're going to enter into this. And um, we left him on the Floor One, so I'm hard-pressed to go back to Floor One. I don't want to go back to Floor One. I want to go to another floor. I want to be safe. That's what I want to do. But right now, we're just going to stay in the elevator. That's what we're going to do. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Let's see. Uh, okay. Emotionally, am I prepared? Uh, 
uh, let me know if you, uh, when you're going to send the art so that I'm not in a place or a location where Jimmy Jam can murder me. <laughs> or if you're going to send it later. Uh, that way I can just, you know, not, not stress the heck around. <laughs> okay. Wow. That is so cute. You know, her little horn reminds me of like the alicorn design from the last unicorn which is such an underrated and beautiful movie okay you can watch it after the stream okay awesome then i'm gonna go ahead and i'm gonna go to i'm gonna go to floor three i'm gonna go to floor three this is actually the floor that we were sleeping on before jimmy jam murdered someone which is what alerted us to the fact that he is a murderer. So, uh, not really hard pressed to be on there, but we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna be on here. And that's awesome, right? So he can't really be on this floor yet. So we're just gonna see what uh, we can access while we're here. Okay, 309, okay, perfect. We're in 309. Let's see what's in these drawers. We found a coil wire. We found another compass. Perfect, perfect sauce. Uh, he can't be on this floor yet, so just move freely. Don't, don't worry about if he's gonna kill you. Just move freely. Okay, so. <laughs> okay, okay, so we found another storeroom key. Perfect, love that. Um, we hit on the same drawer. Sorry. Okay. That one is what we're trying to look through. Okay. I think right. we accessed both of them. So we're going to be fine. And <laughs> yeah, he takes a while to move from floor to floor. So we should be fine for a hot minute. Uh, he usually learns where we are really quickly though. So don't, you know, ever think that you're safe. Uh, love that. Love that for us. It is really dark. We imagine not using the elevator. You can actually run down the stairs if you want to. Um, sometimes it's better to do that, although I can't imagine the reason why. So because he knows that we have moved from that floor, and he's probably picked up that we've moved from that floor, he's probably going to try and meet us on ground floor, uh, I mean on floor three, which means that we can escape to floor one. <laughs> Jimmy Job Jr. uses echolocation. I'm pretty sure he killed his dad, so uh, that was actually a pretty close <laughs> image in meeting him on the stairs. He can't access you on the stairs, if I remember correctly. He cannot access you on the stairs. So this one is out of order. Um, but I think this is the stairs right here. Nope, I was wrong. I was absolutely wrong. Uh, never mind. <laughs> But I do know that he can't get you on the stairs. Um, so the elevator, the stairs, you're usually safe. <laughs> Why is my heart racing right now? She's running. She's like, mm -hmm. <laughs> no. <laughs> oh, she's not having a fun time. Okay. So I don't actually know if it's a good idea to go to floor two. <laughs> but... Um, we're gonna go to floor two. We're gonna see what floor two has in store for us. <laughs> Hi, Pocky, it's nice to see you. Uh, we are facing our fears, unlike last time. Uh, okay, so we're in the store and the store is bright, so that's great, but is there anything in here for us to interact with? Look in the first floor store near the stairs to get the damn scrying machine. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Can I interact with this? I cannot. So, oh, perfect. Oh, it's too damn dark. We're going, we're leaving. It's too dark. Okay. 
<laughs> Hi! Hi there. Okay. We're gonna go through the stairs. Nope. We can't access the stairs. Uh... Hi! Thank you so much for following. I appreciate it. Okay, I, it doesn't look like I- I thought I had collected the stair keys, but it doesn't look like I have actually collected the stair keys. So that is discomforting. We're gonna go ahead and see if we can attract Jimmy Jam to floor three. We're gonna really try to attract- thank you so much for following, Teal. Love it. <laughs> we're gonna see if we can get Jimmy Jam on floor three, and then we're gonna run really quickly, like, extremely fast to uh, floor. Okay. Do we not have the stair key? I swear we have the stair key. This is the wrong key. Okay. So we do not actually have access to the stairs. <sighs> Dang -orang. And here I was praying that we had access to the stairs. We've already been down this road. I remember the location. Um, Jimmy Jam. Jimmy Jam Jamboree, please. Okay. Okay. Emotionally, we can handle this. Emotionally, we are set to handle this. I hate the way this freaking camera moves. I hate it so much. We walked into a dark room. Love it. Leaving the dark room. <laughs> uh, his name is, in fact, Jimmy, but uh, I call him Jimmy Jam Jamboree. I call him Jimmy Jam because what could be a funner name you know okay so we found 301 okay so we found some broken wall mirrors i don't know what that means i don't know what that entails <laughs> jimbala jimmy joe jim job jim bob same wavelength <laughs> so you plan on streaming during these hours usually i actually stream usually closer to the night but i was like you know what i'm gonna stream i'm gonna stream really early today i woke up and i was like we're streaming we're doing it we're making it happen and here we are we've done it we've made it happen <laughs> But I might uh, try streaming closer. I might stream horror games specifically in the, in the morning. So it's easier on my heart. So just to answer the question, it's so much easier on the heart. Oh, we're going to go to floor one. Is we, we're done being a coward. And maybe Jimmy Jam has moved to floor one at this point. <laughs> You know is he here I'm so I don't want to be here okay fuck okay we're here thank god all right so there has to be something here um right like, it wouldn't just tell me to keep coming here for no reason, right? Okay, so... Ari is far away. Glad I caught the stream. Would have been sleep later, because time zones. No, I hear you. <laughs> Salt is meatloaf, and you attract him. <laughs> Your meatloaf ain't shit, Jimmy. <laughs> And he's like, I'm going to kill you with this. <laughs> okay. It seriously kept telling me to come here. So I have to interact with something. I'm going to just click a bunch of stuff. And, you know, maybe... <laughs> it's his grandmother's recipe. <laughs> he was just outside. The thing about it is, I've already died. So he can't get me that bad. I've already died one time. So he, no matter what, it cannot be as awful as the one time he already got me. So. <laughs> okay. Okay. I've got to look in the first store near the stairs for the device. This is the stairs. Why? Why isn't it here is the question. Okay. So this is a storeroom. Nothing. 
Okay, let's see. Oh, we locked the door. So we, we officially know that we can lock the door here and be safe and interact with things. But I don't feel like this is a very welcoming store as somebody who has like run a store herself at some point in her life. There, it's got to be here somewhere, but nothing, nothing's coming of it. So we're going to unlock the door. <laughs> Where am I supposed to get the scrying mirror? I can't advance the game without it. It's got to be here, right? This is the one they kept telling me to come to. This is the one I ran to just to try and advance the story. <laughs> His grandma ain't shit. I'm sure she's lovely. I mean, sure, she just only raised a murderer. So... <laughs> Come out now. Do you hear him? He's calling me. He's seeking me. He wants to murder me. What am I supposed to do? What am I supposed to do? Okay. Does this work here? Does this work here? No, 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 no. We know we have the turpentine, we have the lighter, we have the storeroom, we have the child's purse, we saw the girl in the basement. Um, wow, he's real close. He is super close. Jimmy Jam wants to throw hands. He wants to murder me very much. And it's because he saw me, saw, see him kill people. <laughs> But can I also say that he basically just locked all the rooms in the hotel to make sure that I wouldn't get out. And if this was real life, I would not be playing uh, this game. I would break the dang <laughs> front door. I would run. <laughs> I would flee super duper hard. Okay. <laughs> we wouldn't be playing this game. Um, it does sound like he's going a little more distant, but if it says that Jimmy's running towards us really fast, then we're probably going to die. So that's fun. Yeah. So that's fun. <laughs> okay. We're going to leave the room. I'd be dead already. <laughs> okay. We're in room 106 now. Um, I don't know if I collected anything from here before. Potentially I did. Okay, so we, yeah, we were in here. We saw the child's purse. Um, <laughs> Jimmy Jam seems to be deaf. Yeah, um, he's not really that deaf. If you call to him, he will come by. Uh, and that's actually how I died the first time. I was trying to distract him into coming by so that he could, like, move on, you know? Like, get out of the way. <laughs> I doubt most people would survive any horror situations we see in games. Okay. This is the one that it wants me to come to. But nothing seems to be working. So we're going to go ahead and we're going to leave via the lift. And we're going to go to floor three again. Um, maybe I'm just not seeing something. Maybe I'm not finding something. I don't know. Uh, but I seem to not be able to, oh wait, you can, yeah, you can call him. You can call him. Um, like, uh, you can definitely call him. So 301 is, uh, 301 through 307 are this way. Uh, he can't be on this floor, so we're safe for now. Uh, do, do, do. I hate the way this freaking camera's moving. And we're in the dark, so we're leaving the dark room. Never mind, we weren't here. <laughs> Why do we have his number? We just call him very vocally. We're like, Jimma Jam, Jimma Jam, Jamboree, is you here? <laughs> and he's like, I am here, in fact. And <laughs> then he kills you. <laughs> Um, he kind of does look a little bit like Tom Hiddleston when you're not, you know, uh, <laughs> afraid. So, <laughs> um, I, I don't think he's actually a bad looking man. Uh, if it weren't for the fact that he wears a mop on his head, he would be very attractive. <laughs> and, you know, also the fact that he kills people. He would be a lot more attractive if he didn't do that. Uh, you know? Uh, <laughs> 
but he does, so that sucks. Uh, oh, that's the pits. We were here already, we saw this place. Here's the door to the store, but the store. <laughs> Just Skyping him casually. <laughs> but it's so sexy to see someone covered in blood. <laughs> no, okay. Nothing. Okay, I don't know what that room is. I legitimately thought he was in the stairway. I legitimately saw that little head thingy and I was like, shit. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna go to floor two. We're gonna go to floor two and That was like a very unpleasant, um, if I remember correctly, I wasn't on floor too long because it looked like it was way too dark to really access. Yeah, seems really dark to access. It's in here though. Let's see if this will open anything, anything, anything opening, nothing, nothing is opening. Stopping yourself from swearing by saying a different swear word is energy I resonate with. <laughs> well, thank God. <laughs> okay, we've got to seriously find the keys, but I'm very afraid of Jimmy Jam and I don't want to be on floor one because it looks like he's staying on floor one until the lights turn on for floors three and two so we're gonna go back to floor one because we're not we're not scared we're gonna do this if jimmy kills us jimmy kills us we don't die in real life remember that what kills you in a game does not kill you in real life <laughs> shit <gasps> floor, floor. <laughs> that was bad. That was just terrible. That was horrible. What does he get there? <laughs> I was here like, I can do this. I can be on the floor. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> no, thank you. <laughs> okay. Let's just see. Is anything open? <laughs> oh, God. That was too much on my heart. It's racing. I'm... <laughs> I was just trying to go from place to place. What do you want from me? Let's see. Does this open anything? No. Okay. Okay. Uh, does this one open anything we've got a lot of keys we've got a lot of keys you know uh, at this point in time no not not working uh, this is also the wrong key nothing got it perfect love it uh, <laughs> so we at least know that these keys will not work here Okay, so the stair door will not work here, but we're gonna try the stair door, uh, stairs to floor one anyway, and it doesn't work. I might, I'm scared to think what happens to Sue if she plays Alien Isolation. I, I did play uh, Alien Isolation at one point in my life, uh, just so you know, at one point. <laughs> Um, but, uh, I closed the game really quickly, so, <laughs> that's any indication of what's gonna happen. We're gonna go to floor, no, I didn't mean to floor one. Do you think Jimmy's on the floor already? Do you think he's still waiting? Like, he knows at this point we can only enter floor one by the elevator, right? So if I was Jimmy, I would just wait by the elevator. What if I open the door and Jimmy's just right there? Like, that would be... Horrifying. 
Never playing a game again means you be. That's sweet. That's a sweet uh, sentiment. No, I closed it. Never played it again. As soon as it played for like a minute. <laughs> She's still alive after playing. The game is streamable, boys. <laughs> okay. So, <laughs> let's see. I swear I should be able to interact with more things on the ground floor. Okay, so let's see if this will work. No, she said, never mind. Um, <gasps> I can go up the stairs. Never. All right. Bye. He's waiting. Did you see that? He was right there. <laughs> Never mind. He was just right there. He was waiting. He was waiting on me to exit. Jimmy is literally waiting for me and I don't know what to do. I don't know how to attract him to the other uh, levels. I'm, I'm stressed. I'm super stressed out right now. <laughs> okay. Um, he's waiting by the door. He's just waiting. He's just chilling. The stairs are somehow more terrifying than the elevator. <laughs> right. <laughs> I was literally just going to go up to the stairs to unlock the stairs. And, and that is no longer a viable option. So let's just see if any of our keys will open this. That is, no. Okay. Perfect. Love it. Uh, this is key to 119. This is not going to work. Um, I believe if you click on all the keys, even though you know that it's not the right key, it stops you from eventually clicking on the key, which could help me in the later end. So I'm just going to click on it, even if I know it's the wrong key. So <laughs> it will tell me and it won't let me do it beforehand. So. I should get go get go get some food. We'll be back soon. All right, you get your food. You enjoy that food. Um, can't leave. Cannot leave. Love it. Love it. Hydrate. Stretch. Um, eat some cake. If I was Jimmy, I would just wait. I would just continue to wait. Oh my God. Oh my Jesus Christ. I don't know why we needed the campus. Compass, sorry, the compass, not the campus. <laughs> Just the campus here. Hi, Robin. <laughs> nice to see you playing a horror game, living the life, being afraid. That's what we do in this household, you know. Um, so Jim has to be waiting for us on floor one because we already established he was waiting by the stairs, he was waiting by the the elevator. Um, <laughs> yeah, Jimmy. Jimmy's our murderer in this game. So we're playing a game where a guy wants to kill us and we're doing everything to make sure that doesn't happen. So... Try the door first. Okay, we locked the door because he was coming. <gasps> we found it. We got it. We got it. We got it. We got it. Oh, thank God. Okay, we got it. Awesome. All right. <laughs> <sighs> ah! still have this crying thingy. Okay. <laughs> Sorry, 
sorry about that, guys. That was a lot. <laughs> okay. What door are we on? Because knowing him, he threw us in a very far door. Now 11, the final season is streaming baby. Awesome. Okay. 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 We're making it through. We're getting out. That's what's happening. It's only as bad as you let it be. Just remember that. Did he take your stuff? We just got your stuff. I don't know. I think he took my stuff. I think he took my stuff. <laughs> yeah, he took my stuff. He took my thing. It's telling me to go get my thing. Uh-huh. Okay. We gotta go get. We gotta go get it. Okay, we got the sword already. Um. <laughs> he took the stuff. He took our stuff. He seriously took our stuff. He took our things. <sighs> you can't ninja around the meeting or anything. If you really can't, def drink some water if you have it or close to access, good replacement for it. I can't get the sword. I would love to collect the sword. What, what happened, Cliff? <laughs> okay, we're gonna go ahead and leave. I hate the fucking way this fucking. <laughs> Sorry. We're in room 108 now. We were just here. He's waiting for us. We're gonna look through the glass. <laughs> I locked the door. How did he get me? I'm still so thought. Like, how did he get me? How did he seriously get me? <laughs> yeah, you should definitely eat. I thought you left to eat. Did you not get your food? Get your eats? Get your yum yum? Salt hand. <laughs> That's a clever way to doing. <laughs> yeah, salty. I'm definitely salty. I don't know how he got me. I was literally so careful. I was so cautious. Doesn't seem like he's close by. We're gonna leave again. Okay, so we've died twice. What's he gonna do? Kill us again? Huh? <laughs> That's my thought process here. What's he gonna do? Kill me twice? <laughs> <laughs> Still, though, hope you're able to get your feast on. Yeah, get your food. Okay, so he's closer. This is a store that has nothing in it. Love it. Jimmy Jobs, do be sneaky. He do be sneaky. He do be sneaky. <laughs> I don't know why it went down the hallway. I didn't tell it to go down the hallway. <laughs> okay. 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 <laughs> We're good. We're good. We're fine. We're all right. We lived uh, even though we were killed. Even though we were killed, we're fine. <laughs> this is a dark room. This does nothing for me. <laughs> Sue, really? If you said to Jimmy, I'm here. <laughs> Couldn't resist how handsome he was. Just ran towards him. <laughs> You're right. You're right. I 
just wanted him to know that I loved him. <laughs> I would die for him. <laughs> okay, so we've already found the trophies. I just want the scrying thing. I just want the scrying thing. That's it. At the end of the day, I just want the scrying thing. Jimmy killed me once. That was a mistake. Jimmy killed me twice. Shame on me. Jimmy killed me thrice. Duh. <laughs> In love with Jimmy. J <laughs> An uncomfortable series where we slowly come to learn that somebody's like, super into the concept of not really getting murdered because he doesn't really seem like he's capable of actually murdering me for whatever reason. Sue is yandere, seeing how she keeps looking out for Jimmy, but whenever he's close, she runs away. <laughs> how can you not be? <laughs> oh, he's really close. We're gonna just wait for him then. We're just gonna wait for him to leave. Sue Yandere confirmed. <gasps> so scandalous. You learned my secret. Oh my god. <laughs> How did you find out? I swear I didn't tell anybody. <laughs> Sue was never the victim the whole time. The whole time it was Jimmy. <laughs> I'm the one who went to the hotel. I'm the one who killed those people. It's Jimmy who's trying to run away. <laughs> and I'm hunting Jimmy down. <laughs> what a story. Uh, how complex. <laughs> I think you can. In your heart, I think you can believe in your heart of hearts that this was true. You had us in that first... <laughs> <laughs> clever clever okay so it does seem like he's not really calling out to me anymore and last time he did it was distant so i think i can get out now okay so we gotta get back to the store the good thing about this is that through this horrible death situation um through dying he's no longer by the stairs i saw his shadow um so that's why i'm hiding right now uh <laughs> uh i'm sure he's not gonna get me but you know he might enter the room uh, <laughs> you couldn't feel less for long. <laughs> I feel like bringing out the conspiracy theory, me. <laughs> Do -do -do. <laughs> You're rooting for Jimmy now. <laughs> He's just trying to live, and I'm just hunting him down. You know what? Fair. Fair enough. Fair enough. <laughs> okay. So I saw his shadow run by the light when I tried to escape through the elevator, which means he is not letting me near the stairs for crap, my dude. He is like, I'm going to ruin your life. <laughs> okay. So uh, <clears throat> through the spyglass, it doesn't look like there's much going on. We just have to get to the store in order to get our scrying material again. Um, because he took it the first time, the bastard. Um, we gotta escape with our scrying material, too. Food time! Ooh, delicious. Tell me what you're getting. Okay. Feast! Okay, I heard him again. But he was distant. So I'm feeling like I could probably escape. But I don't know what I'm gonna do. I really don't know what I'm gonna do. Sorry, you might see my avatar moving. That's because when I get stressed, I try to stand up. <laughs> see ya, Teal. Thank you so much for joining in. Uh, hope to see you again sometime. Okay, so. Building up our confidence. Being strong. Being bold. We are the strong person in this scenario. We're stalking Jimmy. Jimmy's not stalking us. <laughs> 
Jimmy can be heard somewhere. Yes, we see the gang. <laughs> Well, <laughs> awesome. There he went. There he walked. Bye bye, Teal. Love to see you again sometime. Get your food. And. <laughs> okay, Jimmy walked by in his little clown hair with his little mop. I think it's a mop. It might be an axe. Could be a mop, though. Open to the idea of it being a mop. I want it to be a mop so bad. Uh <laughs> we're going to go ahead. He, he walked by. And we're going to wait 10 seconds. One, two, three, four, five, six. He made another noise. We're waiting again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Sultan Chan is coming for you, Jimmy. Here we are. We're going out there. Okay. 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 All right. Go into the door. Go into the door. Go into. Nope. No, not working. He walked the other way. We're leaving. We can't do this. We're not emotionally available for this. in the normal capacity, okay? That's what I was doing. <laughs> I was acting in the general capacity that I should, or I thought I should act, okay? I should confess your feelings. <laughs> what is normal? You know, running away, be being afraid. Maybe he doesn't like me. Maybe Senpai is not after what I got, okay? <laughs> We're gonna go to the ground floor. <laughs> Invite him under the sakura tree behind the school. <laughs> okay. We're going to the gr lower ground floor because we're going to try and access the staircase. And hopefully he will not be by the elevator this time. If I remember correctly, there is a stair. I can access through the stairway here. So, we're going to access through... This was not locked before. Hold on. This was open. Um, did he come down here just to lock it? That's, that's messed up. <laughs> Jimmy. <laughs> <laughs> maybe I'll just draw like maybe what I'll do is I'll go ahead and I'll bake him a bunch of cookies that are shaped like animals and things like that and then we'll <laughs> put a love letter in his locker next to those huh how's that <laughs> it did open I swear it opened okay so we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna see if there is an access way Valentine's cookies sound perfect. <laughs> We're gonna go to the ground floor. We're gonna see if we can access the stairway. Um, through the ground floor some <laughs> somehow. We've gotta be able to do this, right? So. So we're going to go ahead and we're going to try. There's got to be access to the stairwell somewhere in this place. So we're going to find... We, we just got to find it, right? It's not here. And we got the kitchen going on. Um, I don't know why I can't like take... Oh, this is not a kitchen. Is it a kitchen? It looks like a kitchen. I'm going to say it's a kitchen. Does Jimmy ever come on the elevators? Cook them chocolates! <laughs> Jimmy does come onto the elevator if you're not fast enough. Um, and I think the elevator is his main mode of transportation. So you can, in fact, 
you know, ride with Jimmy. It's not going to be a fun ride, uh, but it is a ride that is possible. <laughs> okay, wrestling mania. Um, nothing on this in this floor has been accessible, but there's no way that I can't access the stairway, right? Too dark to travel ahead. Um, <laughs> Man, sounds pretty fun to me. Jimmy, getting brave, jumping you on the elevator. <laughs> he loves me so much, you know? This is literally the front door, and if it were me, I would just break the glass. If I was stuck in this situation in real life, I would just break the glass, I would run away. That's what I would do. But I can't because games. I don't know why, like, I don't, I would... I'm, I'm not joking. I would have got the sword. I collected the sword at some point. Why can't I use the sword on Jimmy? Just slice him through, you know? Uh, <laughs> okay, so here's the stairwell door. The elevator is the literal equivalent to the stair <laughs> If we turn around and he's there again, I don't know what I'm gonna do. Just go, just pull him and stab him. <laughs> He was right there. He can't get you while you're on the stairway. So we're just gonna... <laughs> the stairway is safe. The stairway is home. Uh, <laughs> show him what you got. <laughs> this whole thing is just turned into like, you guys trying to teach me how to flirt with Jimmy Jam. <laughs> Okay, um, I'm afraid. That's all I gotta say about this. I am terrified, I'm scared. I don't wanna be here, I'm frightened. <laughs> Run him hands, Jimmy. <laughs> okay, it doesn't seem like he's present, so we're gonna open the door. Or we're gonna try the door anyway. Love that. Love that. Okay, we unlocked the first floor door. Okay. Breathe in, breathe out. Going into the location where the enemy is. Going into the location where your crush is. Uh, it's, it's the same thing, right? The enemy is your crush, your crush is the enemy. We're walking in. stressed. That's what I am. He's gotta be here right by the doors. Likes her man impatient and murderous. Yes. Okay. <laughs> How long until Jimmy spawns on the scene again? That's my question. That's really my question right now. Can't open this.
locking the storeroom again. Fuck you, Jimmy. Uh, <laughs> we got it. We did it. You got our gear. I'm so happy. I'm so happy. We got our gear. We got it. We are, we got our stuff. We got it. And now we're going to unlock the door. We're going to go to, we're going to run to the elevator. We're going to fucking leave. We're going to fucking leave. We're going to go. <laughs> I wonder how he does, uh, he's coded. Does he actually traverse or does he just appear? Okay. Uh, I don't know. I do know that he takes a while to get from floor to floor. That is what I do know. So you can effectively, when that is in motion, you know, be, be cool. You can be fine. So we're going to go in here. And the entire reason that we needed that scrying little device is because there's a dead girl here. Let's see if we can turn it on. Start a conversation by asking an introductory question. If there's no reply, there's no spirits around. A loud noise means there's a spirit in the high energy state near. Is anyone there? Okay, so we got a little girl. See? He walks through the multiverses to get the perfect moment. Is anyone there? Okay, so she can hear. Okay, let's see. Spirit is too distant from us. Okay, how do we get in closer? You need to find the scrying mirror. This is giving you some creepy vibes. Is someone there? Nothing. Okay, a spirit is making contact. Okay, let's ask if she's the girl in the basement. What's your name? Is creepy nostalgia in thing? <laughs> Sorry, I'll stop haunting you. Okay, the girl's name is Amy. She's 10 years old. Oh, she's British. <laughs> she's a British little ghost. You'll see their reply when selecting the item. Now in contact with Amy. Now, nah, okay. Who did the child's purse belong to? It was mine. It was for my birthday, but it was stolen. Who stole your purse, little girl? Oh, never mind. You found her. Sorry, I'll stop haunting you. Okay. Hi, Teal. Nice to see you back. Um, I saw a girl in the basement crying. Who was she? That was her. It was me. Well, that didn't sound good. Did anybody else hear a door lock? No? I know I'm safe on the ground floor. So I'm not <laughs> Jimmy stole from the child. Okay, let's Who see. Who does the sword belong to? Jimmy is not below that. <laughs> Nick Stab. Jimmy had the sword. Wow. What the frick. What was the coil of wire used for? Jimmy used to carry it around with him. Okay, so Jimmy used to carry around the coil. How did those mirrors get broken? I don't know. So she doesn't know about the broken mirrors. Let's talk about the trophies. I found some trophies. Who won them? Voice was vaguely I saw heard. Some suitcases in a chest. Who did they belong to? She doesn't know. I found a bottle of turpentine and a lighter. What were they for? I didn't know what they were until Jimmy showed me. Huh. Okay. So she didn't know what they were until Jimmy showed her. Okay. Showing the found items. Match two replies together. And we'll see. Uh, let's see. I think maybe the broken mirror. Uh, pair, sighting, and objects. Okay. So. 
The purse was mine. It was stolen for my birthday, but it was stolen. Okay, so she got the purse for her birthday. That sounds absolutely delicious. Cheese and chicken in my sandwich. That does sound good. And I haven't eaten, so that sounds really good to me right now, in truth. I'm really hungry, suddenly. Okay, uh, let's see. How do I pair things? That's my question. The purse was mine, but it was stolen. How did she get locked in the basement? That's what I want to know. Showing everything. When you said Jimmy stole things from you, is that connected with what you said about the purse? Yes, he took it when I wasn't looking and stole my money. He stole her money? We wouldn't listen. <laughs> no! Okay, okay, so we're seeing something now. Saw G. Jimmy wouldn't listen. Okay. Jimmy wouldn't listen. How did she get into the basement though? Jimmy, friend of the year. <laughs> Let's see. Um, maybe I'll eat after after I stream for a good amount of time. Yeah, but not right now. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Let's see. <clears throat> okay. What haven't I asked about yet? I haven't asked about the keys, but I don't imagine she'd know anything about the keys. Is someone there? Is she not here anymore? Who's there? She leave? Hello? Okay. I think she left. She's not here anymore. Hello. The little girl left. Is someone there. <laughs> Sustenance. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna go head. <clears throat> and then do we call the lift? Do we go up the stairs? We get jumped by Jimmy again. All of these things sound like plausible options. <laughs> so we went to the ground floor and Jimmy wouldn't listen. And then, and then um, I saw the G in the, I saw the G in the memory that we sort of saw. But where is the scrying mirror is the real question. Let's go ahead and go to the lower ground. We're going to go to the ground floor. Um, where it's safe for a moment and we're just gonna see if we can find anything if we can just like contact anyone anywhere let's just see if the scrying mirror works anywhere there's sounds from the arcade So that happened, let's see if she's here. Is it Amy? Yeah. Okay, she's here, she is here. Okay, we got her. Okay, so let's see. I saw you shouting to Jimmy to give your toy back. Why did he take it? Yeah, why did he take it? Because he thought it was funny. Because he thought it was funny. Back, but, then it anyway. but then he ruined it anyway. Okay. What you said about Jimmy stealing your toy, is that connected with what you said about the purse? Yeah, I mean, obviously, but you've got to be absurdly a front of then. Jimmy needs to get McStabbed confirmed. <laughs> You've paired these already. Okay. I've already paired these. When you said Jimmy stole things from you, 
Is that connected with what you said about the purse? I thought we clicked on the girl in the basement. If the ghosts really wanted to talk to us, they'd be the one inventing technology to talk to humans. Why must we do all the work for them? <laughs> okay, so let's put the turpentine and the lighter together. She said that he what ruined it, so maybe he set it on Does fire. Have something to do with what you said about the turpentine and lighter? So he did, in fact, set her toy on fire. guess they weren't really transparent about that. <laughs> so he soaked her toy in lighter fluid. <clears throat> but why? Is she still Is here? There? She's not here anymore. You need to find the scrying mirror. I heard you the first time, game. I heard you the first time. All right. <laughs> Now set Jimmy on fire. Let's just set the whole place on fire. How's that? Let's just <laughs> run away. <laughs> okay. She's not here anymore. I don't know where she went. What did she she tell us? She told her that she soaked the toy. But what did she say? Was it on ground floor one? Oh my god. Do we have to go to floor one? I don't want to go to floor one. Let's burn the discount clown on fire. <laughs> a clever little thing to do I should hope yeah game for the 27th time get the mirror <laughs> where is the mirror that's what I'd like to know <laughs> but Jimmy is already <laughs> is Jimmy so hot is he <laughs> we're hired him from Craigslist this is like that life of luxury thing where we hired a clown from the dark web. <laughs> the mop on his head does things. We're going to go to the lower ground just to make sure that she's no longer there first. And then we're going to go to the floor one if nothing else actually comes of it. <clears throat> okay. So we're here. Let's see if she's here. Is anyone there? She's not here. Okay, I can go in here and see if she's here. Hello. Is anyone there? Nothing. Got it. Love it. Okay. We need the scrying mirror. I heard you. I heard you. I heard you. I heard you. <laughs> Things no one should feel about a mop. <laughs> I don't know. Mops can be pretty, mm, you know. I can't believe he locked the basement door. That is so unnecessary. <laughs> it's just so freaking unnecessary. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna go to the ground floor and we're gonna see if the stairway will do us any good because honestly, every time I've tried to access the staircase, He's just been there. <laughs> Mops can be pretty persuasive, you know. <laughs> Do we know? Should we know is the better question. Okay, so what did we see in the in the thing? So she said she soaked the the it was soaked. Let's just see if we can connect real quick to the girl again in the arcade. Maybe she's still there, you know. Um I don't think she is. Is someone there? Is someone there? She's not here. Let's just see if we can find anybody anywhere else in the game, though. Because I don't want to go. <laughs> Doing everything I can to avoid. Okay, let's see if any of these keys will work. <laughs> they absorb a lot of love. <laughs> Unmops can uh, <laughs> unmops your head. Okay, so we got room one one nine, key to the storeroom. Is anyone there? Hey, it's me, Jimmy. What up? <laughs> oh, every time he gets me, it's horrifying. <laughs> 
was a <laughs> okay so the arcade's doing nothing for us the did we go to um the kitchen though let's go to the kitchen there's got to be something going on in the kitchen that's why else would we have access to it right is someone there who's there no, nobody's in the kitchen. Love it, love it, hate it, love it. Okay. There's two Jimmies now. The plot thickens. <laughs> it's me, Jimmy, but I'm Jimmy. <laughs> Sue fell for a twin. <laughs> Is the other one its name Timmy, perhaps? <laughs> a recipe for disaster. We're gonna have to go to the floor one. Okay. Emotionally preparing myself for floor one. Wishing I had water is what I'm doing right now. Okay, so I have no idea which room we found the person, but I do think I need to like look for it. I think I need to look for the purse. I'm gonna just see if there's anybody, okay, <laughs> maybe not. Maybe we shouldn't do that. Maybe talking is going to attract Jimmy, I don't know. <clears throat> where is the scrying mirror game? Tell me where it is. If, I want, if you want me to have it so bad, tell me where it is. <laughs> Imagine he pops out the chest. He was just like crouched up in there like a ventriloquist. Sorry, not a ventriloquist. <laughs> that is a horror, right? Chat turned into comedy. <laughs> no, I don't think I will. Okay. Okay, so 117 is definitely like... I know that she said to go to floor one through the memory visage thingy, my bobber. Okay. <laughs> Teal, correction, romantic comedy. <laughs> love it, love it. Okay. One of these rooms has to be the room that we found the thing in, right? So we're just gonna quickly, um, I think we have the, the key to 119. So we're gonna lock this door, just you know, give the middle finger to the door. You can't see it, but I'm doing it really hard. I'm just, okay. You need to find the scrying mirror. Okay, let's see if anybody is in here. So Jimmy can be heard somewhere. Hard eyes, yonder. <laughs> it's us just chasing him down. <laughs> Honestly, it would be really creepy. Okay, so he's heard walking nearby. But is he like walking by by? Uh, <laughs> Coming soon near you. <laughs> this is like a Scooby Doo uh, chase sequence if we really think about this. We need this, yes. <laughs> okay, we're just gonna see. Hello? Nothing, nothing come of this. Okay, but we do have the lock for room 119. Okay, you heard him, right? You can hear him, he's talking. He's giving out strong aura. <laughs> Amy really did. <laughs> what was what <laughs> yeah she did she ditched us <laughs> she didn't tell us where to go or what to do or where to be but she just was just like you know <laughs> amy saw we didn't have a mop on her head <laughs> i heard him effing scream for some reason sue just sliding into the ghost dms like that <laughs> Uh, yeah, he screams at random. He's like, you know, he... Yeah, you heard him this time? 
Okay, we just unlocked the door, and I feel like that was really loud, and I know he was near us, so we're just gonna hide in the restroom. <laughs> I don't like that you can just audibly hear the key to the door. I swear I heard something walk up, but maybe I'm wrong. Sue has joined the ghost chat. <laughs> Bathroom break, good call. <laughs> Jim Bob just trips over sometimes. It's part of his charm. <laughs> We're just very deeply in love with Jim Bob. <laughs> BRB, gotta go real quick. <laughs> to the loo real quick. <laughs> okay, so that was a minute that we were in the bathroom and he can't be still close by, can we? We're gonna give it a count of five. One, two, three, four, five, nothing. We're gonna open the door. We're gonna, we're gonna go, I guess. I know I need to find the fucking scrying mirror game. Thank you. You heard him, right? He was saying something. I don't know what he was saying. <laughs> but he's, he was saying something. <laughs> okay, see. <laughs> so, anyway, about that mirror. <laughs> see if Amy can. Okay. I, I don't want to talk while he's close by. That's the thing about it. Can he hear me? Is he going to come? I don't know. I don't know enough about the game to be, to make these accurate assessments. Let's just Hello. ask. Is someone there? Every time she talks, it just gives me a miniature heart attack. Can I just say that? I suggest you find it to make progress. But where am I supposed to find it? That's the question. I think we've established that you need the mirror first. Okay, yes. where is the fr a scrying mirror? At dead of night. This will be in the guest room at the door or the kitchens as a few examples. Okay. Go to a dimly lit room and then the mirror icon will appear. Nope. What room is the scrying mirror? It's on the first floor store from next to the bathrooms. Can always be found at the first floor store room near the bathrooms. Wasn't I just there? Okay. Well, we're on the, um... <laughs> We're on the right floor. <laughs> is the friend we always <laughs> we made along the way. Okay, so is he still out there? Do you did anybody hear him do anything? We could call out to Jimmy. We could do that. Or we could not do that, you know, that's also a thing. Okay, so we unlock the door. Are we in the right room? Is the question? I need the scrying mirror, but where am I supposed to find it? So it's it's on the store floor, on the first floor. He sounded off 20 seconds ago. We heard somewhere, but he wasn't very close, was he? Jimmy ain't leaving and we need to go and we need to find the scrying mirror, which is apparently near the bathrooms. He's heard walking nearby. So we're gonna give it the count to 12, one, Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Leaving the room. And then he just fucking sounds off, doesn't he? <laughs> just walked out of the room to walk into another room because he was he was so close. Watch Sue get jumped as soon as she picks up the mirror. Oh, that was so clever. Oh, thank God I did hide in the room when I hid in the room. Thank Jesus, because that was, like, he was so close. I thought I was just being too precautious. 
Yeah, he would jump me. So he knows I'm in this general vicinity. <laughs> he did it the first time. Why wouldn't he do it again? That's the question. <laughs> he wouldn't let me get the damn scrying thing the first time. Not the other, the, the, the ghost box, I guess. That's what it's called. Um, ghost box. Okay. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Didn't hear anything. We're walking out. <laughs> Jimmy's always close. <laughs> He's always close to our hearts. <laughs> if that's what you mean. Okay. There's got. I, if I remember correctly from watching somebody play a game, uh, there's potentially. Uh, yeah, I'm talking softly as if Jimmy can hear me through the game. <laughs> Nobody's in here. Okay. I thought I could have sworn that there was somebody who did sometimes come when you talked in the trophy room. So. <laughs> Jimmy is on Stockholm Syndrome. Yandere. He's the Yandere of you that you are <laughs> of him. <laughs> okay. So I don't think he's actually anywhere near me. But we're going to open the door. And we're going to run away if he comes running at us. You know? That's the plan. Pick a room, 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 pick a room. He was right there. <laughs> Okay, we picked a room. We can't lock this door. We don't have the access to the key on this door. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I just have the master key, but I don't have the key to lock it. I don't have the door lock. I know that sounds weird, but it's true. <laughs> I don't, if I don't have the actual key to the room, I can't lock it. Okay. Why hasn't he come by? That's the thing about it. It's just... Where is he? What's he doing? What are you doing, Jimmy? <laughs> What's the logic in this game? I don't know. Why isn't he making noises? Is he waiting for me? Is he gonna try and jump me? What is it? Is this another stairway situation where I walk in and then he just hits me? Is that what's happening? He's just waiting. I swear to God, he must be, right? Like, he has to be waiting for me outside. I'm just gonna hide in the bathroom. You'll excuse me. Just <laughs> He has to be waiting for me. He's, this doesn't make sense otherwise. <laughs> okay, we're just gonna wait. We're gonna give it a 20 second count. And if, if he gets us after that, then he was just really patient. You know, he was just super patient. And I guess at that point he deserved it. Like, I, I guess. <laughs> Sue just went to the do not disturb on the hotel's Discord. <laughs> <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Okay, opening the door. Uh, he hasn't done anything. He hasn't made any noises. He hasn't looked for me. He hasn't come by. I'm super upset. I, I don't know what to do. Um, <laughs> 67, 68, 69. <laughs> okay. We're just gonna, uh, <laughs> we're in room 116. Okay. He's walking by. He's walking by. So he does, he, he is looking for us. He is. Okay. 
Good. So he actually is moving now. Thank God. Because if he kept staying by the stairs, we were dead. We were dead. It looked like he was just lurking there for a long time, which is why I didn't want to move. Um, but is he actually walking by by? I want to hear him talk. Like, just say something, Jimmy. Say something to let me know how close you are. <laughs> he was camping and he got bored. <laughs> there he is. Okay, so he moved by. It looked like he did the other. <laughs> Ara, Ara. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five. Jimmy's still looking. He cares. <laughs> Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. <laughs> He looked at us, hard eye. <laughs> okay, you can hear him. He's sort of making noises. So that means he's like not really that close because of that particular sound. It means he's not really that close. Um, so we could probably escape at this point in time. And Jesus needs us. <laughs> I think we need Jesus more than Jesus needs us right now. We're here, we're locking the door. Okay, so this is the bathroom one, but where is the scrying? He knows we moved, he knows we moved. But there's nothing here for us to take. Okay, Jimmy's mating call, unintelligible screen. <laughs> Where did it say I could find the dang thing? Okay, so it says you can find the device on the first floor store room next to the bathrooms. This is that location. You will need to get this so you can see um, in dark areas. What the hell? <laughs> I don't want to go to dark areas. I can only use it in dark areas. <laughs> and it's beautiful <laughs> so I've been doing it right my whole life why isn't it working <laughs> okay he's somewhere but he's not necessarily nearby Jimmy can be heard walking nearby so he's just walking by so it's just one two Three. I don't want to freaking oh, unlock the door because what if he hears the door go click, 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 and then he's like, oh, she's there. Like, I don't want to do it. <laughs> if you have a mop head that good looking, you don't need to try too hard. <laughs> okay, so he's just camping out near the elevator. He seemed to have understood that this is where I normally regularly hang out. He was just like, this is where the cool kids hang out. By the stairs. And then he's just hanging out, trying to be a part of the cool kids. You're not a part of cool kid, Jimmy. Leave me alone. <laughs> I need to rehydrate. I'm going to be right back. Like, I'm just going to get me my drink real quick. Because... Oh, I, I need it real quick. I'm just gonna get me my drink. water. Stay hydrated. <laughs> Why is the BRB screen also a horror game? <laughs> there is 
no rest for the weary. <laughs> you can take a proper break. <laughs> it's been two hours. You can take a proper break. <laughs> Maybe I should eat something. I don't know. <laughs> Savage. Why not? <laughs> you can never truly escape the horror that is Sue Tetch. <laughs> Okay, I'm back. <laughs> All right, we're back here. We're, we're doing stuff. We're getting noticed by Senpai. We don't want to be more noticed by Senpai. I feel like I waited long enough that he should have left at this point. So me getting up, getting water was definite. Banned is the same as death, <laughs> if you think about it. Okay, what if I open the door and he's just out there, like... <laughs> okay. Okay, we're gonna go. Jimmy left the hotel already. <laughs> you can be unbanned, however. <laughs> that's true. You can't be undead. <laughs> I mean, I suppose you could, but that's more like a terrifying situation with the uh, zombies and everything. So we're gonna leave. <laughs> I'm so sorry. <laughs> Take him a minute to spawn again. <laughs> For the ear blessing. <laughs> Nothing in here. Is there actually death in this game or not? I think you, you will die if you're playing the harder version of the game. walk in. <laughs> Seems he just takes your stuff. Yeah, he just takes your stuff. Okay, the door is closed. <laughs> if you'd ever <laughs> to start over completely. Yeah, that would suck real. <gasps> he took my scrying shit! That bastard. He took my freaking box. Can't believe he took my legendary loot boxes. <laughs> I need to stop dying by him. I can't keep getting these boxes. <laughs> he took my V bucks. Okay, let's see. Let's see. <laughs> I don't know how some people are so unafraid, how they can keep moving even after they've been killed and whatever. <laughs> I don't know how they do it. Because I couldn't. I couldn't. <laughs> I'm clearly not very good at it right now, <laughs> sitting here staring at the spyglass. I swear to God, I thought that he was unable to spawn for a minute after, like, dying. It just works. <laughs> okay, I need the stairs for the device. I need the scrying mirror. I need all this stuff. <laughs> you got this. Thank you. I appreciate it. Okay. He's just nearby. <laughs> be aggressive. Be, be aggressive. <laughs> 
we can do this, we can be aggressive, we can be strong, we can be bold, we can move, we can run, we can do this. We have our hydration, we have our water. No, it's what Jimmy wants. <laughs> He's walking by. Oh, it's definitely a trap. So close to. Okay. So let's see. One. Jimmy can be heard somewhere. One. Jimmy likes it when you're aggressive. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I don't know what to do. said if I had opened the door what would he have done wouldn't the door have like knocked him down like let's be honest wouldn't the door have hit him <laughs> wouldn't we have hit him and it would have hit him <laughs> what's he gonna do like not be hit <laughs> he would have said hello <laughs> that's true he's like, come out now no I don't want to I'm, I want to stay in here where it's apparently safe Jimmy would have welcomed you with open arms and a mop. <laughs> What's your favorite horror movie? Uh, Scream. <laughs> this is too much on my heart. <laughs> I'm feeling like whatever, uh, whatever um, bravery I had earlier today is <laughs> totally depleted. It's completely gone. <laughs> Do you want dinner, uh, bath, or me? <laughs> Classic vine beauties. Def's that dinner. I want that dinner. Okay. He can't be nearby anymore, right? He can't be nearby anymore. He can't, he can't even know where I really am. He knows I opened the door. He doesn't necessarily know I went back into the room that he initially put me in. He can't know that, right? Okay. He's just somewhere. He's just lurking. He's waiting. He's watching. <laughs> Gotta have dinner before anything else after all. <laughs> It's been two hours for Jimmy. <laughs> Jimmy. <laughs> We're invisible. <laughs> I don't think so. He's still lurking nearby. You can hear him talking. I don't know if you guys can because it's like, I, I have it a little bit lower for you guys so you can't, so so it's not competent, com bleh, com competitive, sorry. <laughs> Thank you so much, Tactical Precision, for for following. I appreciate it so much. Um, <laughs> hi, Tactical. <laughs> okay, so we've got to, got to work up our, our, our mental, our mental, our bravery. We got to, heart has got to be strong this time. We got to go. Okay, no noises have been heard. How's it going? It's going well. It's going fine. We're gonna open the door. We're gonna walk out. We're gonna walk out. We're gonna walk. We're gonna move. We're gonna move. We're gonna walk out of the room. We're gonna go. 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 Going, 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 moving. I hear footsteps. I heard footsteps. I heard footsteps. 
Okay. <laughs> Just making a de dead of night into a romantic comedy. <laughs> Jimmy Bob Chan. <laughs> he stole our stuff. He stole our things. He stole all of our things. And now I have to go get them. I have to go get them back. I have to go get them back. Oh my god. Okay. <clears throat> Be brave. Be strong. <laughs> You're capable. <laughs> Jimmy Chan and Sue Chan, the ultimate power couple. Am I right? <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> okay, here's a sword. Wish I could take it. Love to take it. <laughs> So sorry. Wow, that was a lot. <laughs> oh, I'm so sorry. <laughs> Amy keeps scaring me. <laughs> I didn't want to do that. I don't know why she did that to me. What did I ever do to you, Amy? Did I ever? <laughs> I'm in room 109. That means this is the room I'm gonna have to come back to with the with the box when I've got the box. Okay. <laughs> it's ghost flames. It won't actually hurt you. <laughs> she would be here. <laughs> so room 109 is where I have to go. I'm gonna jot that down on a note real quick. <laughs> Go back to for Amy. Amy. Room. 109. Come back to with box. Fucking Jimmy taking my ghost box. I was hoping it was more of a situation where I could keep the ghost box, even if he killed me, you know? I was hoping that was sort of the situation. <laughs> With ghost box. <laughs> Make him mine. <laughs> Her notes. Find Jimmy. <laughs> You know, it's good that he doesn't take the rest of our stuff, right? Like, he's not out here like, Mmm, I'm gonna take these coil liars or these keys or anything. He just takes our boxes. Okay. <laughs> Make him mine. <laughs> okay, so you can hear him. I heard him. Did you guys hear him? I don't know if you guys heard him. But he was out there like, hello. Jimmy is very nice. Jimmy's not nice. He keeps stealing my shit. <laughs> Handwriting ASMR. <laughs> okay. Jimmy walked by. He walked by really fast, which tells me. Okay, so he lurking. Look at that. He's lurking. His... <laughs> Access to all the doors I lock. I'll let her keep them. <laughs> In a way, Jimmy wants this as much as I do. If you think about it, and say the Sundari situation was real, <laughs> he wants me to find him. <laughs> You're streaming out. Jimmy, you cheese. <laughs> okay. 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 We're gonna go. We're gonna go. We're gonna go. Uh, I don't feel like it's personally safe to go, but we're gonna go. We can, we've got to. <laughs> if we die, we die. It's fine. It's not like we have anything on us. <laughs> so we're gonna leave the room. Just click it, just click it, finger, just say you're gonna go. He knows how to play with a maiden's heart. <laughs> he 
does indeed, doesn't he? <laughs> Let's leave the room. Let's quickly check the spyglass. Like, what if he jumps up again? Like, I don't know. I don't, I don't even think there was any indication that he was still there, just sort of lurking by the door. What was he doing that one time when he did that? Was he just, like, looking under the door for feet and then he just came up, like... <laughs> <laughs> gotta head out to the rest because it's like almost 3 a.m but it was great being all here and wishing y'all the best and stay safe and awesome thanks so much robin for joining us um always a pleasure to have you <laughs> jimmy's in defeat yeah he's probably in defeat um uh, okay <laughs> Sweet dreams, sleep well. I hope you have a good one. Door bottoms. <laughs> door bottom. Jimmy's into the weirdest stuff. Have a good rest. All right, let's leave the room. And you know what? If he kills us, he kills us. Like it's not like we have anything. It's fine. We're going. Um, crap. This is the one room that we can't really actually escape from. Don't turn around! Okay, we've been in this room multiple times. Um, let's make sure that nothing's fine. Risk it for the biscuit! <laughs> he puts us in, like, the, the hallway, the long hallway, every single time. Um, except when he puts us in 107. In which case, uh, different things. But... Either way, he puts us very far from the, the, what is the word? Wow, I can't believe I'm blanking out. Elevator, he puts us very far from the elevator each time. And I think he knows that that's our objective to get to the elevator. So I don't hear him, we're gonna leave. If he's out here, I'm gonna scream. But I mean, I think I've proven that I will do that time and time again. He puts you in the long hallway all the time. Maybe he's compensating for something. <laughs> Let's just go into room 1112. Okay, we have the compass. Why doesn't he take our compass? He like never takes our compass. Okay, so this is where the petroleum was found so I'm actually gonna write that down room 112 is where the petroleum was found I'm just gonna write it down real quick room 112 petroleum and then room 109 was where we found the sword I wish we could just take that sword with us yeah. <laughs> it would be so good if we could just take that sword with us but it doesn't look like we can at any point I don't hear him so I don't think he's aware we moved <coughs> which may be good for us maybe we could move out further um, if only <laughs> Well, there he went. <laughs> so whilst you plan on streaming in the future, I like playing The Sims right now. Uh, Sims is something I really like playing. Um, so I'm probably gonna be playing The Sims more often. Um, I'm also gonna stream art streams and uh, a couple of other games that I haven't completely gotten through are Detroit and Near Replicant. <laughs> I do plan on streaming more horror games. I do, it's true. Uh, yeah, yeah, I'm going to do more art, more art, and, uh, uh, let's see, what else, what else, I'm going to do art streams, Jimmy, just freaking mop head, <laughs> I do have a Twitter, I should post more often what I'm going to stream on those days, but I'll tell you, honestly, I, I woke up with a sudden need to play this game this morning, and I usually just go. <laughs> Not as fun as you. <laughs> That's sweet. Okay, so I think he's moving. 
I think he's moved on. I, I want to play Bully. Have you guys ever played Bully? It's like a low poly, horrible little game. I love it so much. I want to play it. <laughs> I just have to figure out how to play it in windowed mode right now. On the PC. I also want to play Pokemon. Um, the new Pokemon Snap game. The chat, the little Pokemon Snap. I want to play that one. Okay. Bully from the original Xbox. I'm going to play Bully from the PC. Uh, I have both of the games. I have all of the bully- I'm a very avid bully fan, so I can actually play it on any platform <laughs> if I wanted to. Oh snap, be right back. Hello, I'm back. <laughs> so I do think that I should probably end the game because I am definitely like not able to progress at this moment. My 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 brain is just not anywhere <laughs> in this survival mode right now. But I think I'll try to pick it up again next Tuesday, probably around the same time that I started this game. But thank you guys so much for joining in. I'm going to end the live stream. I do appreciate you guys coming in. <laughs> and I, I'm going to use this time to go to lunch. Yeah, because I'm hungry as heck. <laughs> thank you so much. <laughs> yeah, thank you for the support. <laughs> I appreciate it. And thank you guys so much for following. It was so fun having you guys in the stream. It was so good to be able to talk to people. <laughs> I was prepared to just like die on my own <laughs> but you guys made it so fun and I'm so glad that you guys joined me and everything and we're gonna pick this up next time um hopefully on the same time same day all right so thank you so much have a good one bye